Hello again. This is my day four in becoming an articulate speaker. And just right now, I finished how to speak in poetry. It was one of the actor who played Voldemort, uh, Ralph Fiennes, his name is. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. He was just saying a particular Swedish poem in English. And there was a certain rhythm to it, which I could just naturally just catch up. Because the one mistake that I have seen myself that I'm doing is whenever I speak, if I'm going to end my sentences, I will keep my mouth open like this, which is not really good because see the difference. If I'm speaking, if I keep my mouth open like this and then move on to the next thought versus if I keep on speaking and I close my mouth. And then I'm going and switching to the next thought. Which of the things that you like the most? See, I did it again. But you do know that the second one was better. Because the moment you close your mouth, you can come and just relax into your thoughts and know the future words that you are going to produce from your psychology. You don't necessarily mean that by stopping some people do not stop because they feel that by stopping, they will be viewed as dim-witted or they will be viewed as they are slow, which ultimately is not the case because the moment you stop to gather your thoughts, relax, and then think before you speak, your words actually hold weightage because you are actually thinking before speaking by shutting your mouth, being relaxed in a cool and composed posture and that is what really matters. Now, for example, today I did not want to do these exercises at all. I just wanted to lay in bed. I did not, I did not do my following routine today. I just did not feel like it. But something inside me said, you should do it because nobody is going to come to save you. You have to do it. There is nobody else. If you, 90% of the people win in life just by showing up. You don't have to do everything perfectly because that is who I was. I was a complete perfectionist. I wanted to do everything perfectly, otherwise not do it at all. And look where it got me. At this moment, I'm not earning that much. My gym membership is going to expire in a few days and I don't know how to renew it. I went from actually being 110 kgs to now I am 95 kgs, which is a big improvement. But if I had just shown up, because I had started these exercises in 2020, if I had just shown up and just looked at myself and be like, fuck it, I am going to continue doing this day in and day out and day in and day out until one day I am going to hone this particular language skills, this particular thinking skills. So this is what I will continue growing my mindset with. That even if I don't feel like it, even if I feel like shit, even if I feel like I'm not, this is not the day, just do it, man. Just do it. Because nobody is coming to save you and you have 24 hours in a day. Instead of scrolling on Instagram, work on yourself. That's all for today. Take care.